Hello and welcome back to Around the Block. This is our second match with the five color deck here on PureMTGO.com. We've won the die roll. We'll elect to play first. This hand doesn't look too strong. There's no fixing, so we're gonna we're gonna ship it back. This one's a little bit better. It's nothing really to to write home about. But Cheese Tomato kept their seven, we'll keep our six, and we'll lead off with the temple. And we'll keep that on top. It at least facilitates casting Reaper. Keep that on top too. I mean, it's not like we've got a, a big rush to cast things in our hand. That one we'll keep on top as well. Doesn't look like there's going to be any plays. So we're going to run out our Planeswalker. Because why not? If it eats a lightning strike and a magma jet, so be it. A, a dissolve, an island, and a temple of abandon. Those are not the things I expected it to eat. And they conceded the game. Uh, I'm assuming we're playing some kind of control or rug control. So we'll bring in planeswalkers. And a couple of fades just to be safe. Uh, we're going to mulligan this hand. We'll keep this one. It's not much better, but it's not much worse either. keep that on top. Again, I don't think that we're in a huge race to actually cast spells and such, so... Curated from my opponent. Uh, let's ship that to the bottom, since we haven't actually seen an enchantment or artifact yet. World Eater has the possibility to be problematic. It will ship Elspeth through the bottom. Wouldn't mind seeing a second black mana.
Faisa. Now I wish I had kept that fade. There's a second black mana. Move that to... Let's keep that on top. Take another five. Master waves. We'll go ahead and destroy the world eater and hope that next turn our Elspeth resolves, even though it won't matter because he'll just make guys unblockable. So let's hope I draw another downfall. That would be cool! Oh, let's at least make him go through the motions. And Cheese Tomato has to go. So I won the match. Hooray. I uh, don't want to play against this guy again because that was the, the mono black deck. Anyways, uh, the tournament practice room. Still not the best place to actually get actual games in. It's the best that I could do. I'm sorry. I apologize. It's just that two man queues aren't firing right now. So um, with that said... I just wanted to bring a couple of examples of the five color deck to you for this article. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and end the recording and on behalf of Psychobabble, thank you for reading Around the Block. I am Joshua Clater for PureMTGO.com. Have a great Friday.